So I thought I'd film a little catch up video since I haven't really made anything since June. I went on holiday to Valencia, which was beautiful and a well needed rest. Um, I highly recommend it to anyone, it's a pretty affordable city, it was really beautiful. Since then I've been working throughout the summer trying to save up as much money as possible so that when I start back at university in September that there's no urgent need for me to look for part-time work so I can focus on my studies, at least to begin with. For the last three weeks I've been back at university in the School of Physics and Astronomy producing a few videos for the school um, some interviews with current staff and students and we're at the moment working on a campus tour video and a tour of the physics building and the school itself just to give prospective students an idea of what life at Nottingham is like. Apart from that, in a couple of weeks time there are some open days at the university and I'll be helping out with those. I'm quite looking forward to talking to the students and parents about Nottingham. So. Besides working throughout the summer and trying to save as much money as possible, I have also been doing a lot of running and I think it has taken over my life. I mean, if I don't talk about running at least six times a day, then something is wrong. You don't know I run? Sorry, did I tell you that I run? The whole reason for this is that at the end of September, my dad will be completing his 1000th marathon, which will be the Robin Hood marathon, which, as you might guess, is in Nottingham. Now, I've always wanted to run a half marathon with my dad, and I've always had the idea that maybe one day I would run a full marathon. However, this seemed like a good opportunity um, because it's in Nottingham. Uh, and just over a year ago, my dad had GBS, I'm not going to try and pronounce it, um, which meant that he was effectively paralysed and had to learn to walk and run again. And he's now running again. Uh, not as fast as before, maybe, but he's uh, not far off, which is amazing and um, so I'd really like to run alongside him to support him and also because it might be one of the only times where I can keep up with him so, uh, <laughs> so that's what I've been training to do. So I've been dragging my boyfriend out every weekend when we do our long runs which basically wipes out half of the weekend um, and it means it's taken over my life. Um, I'm barely drinking because running with a hangover is awful and I I get hangovers on about two pints these days, so that is out of the question now. Um, my social life has taken a hit, so I'm really sorry to, <laughs> to my friends who um, are really bored of me saying I can't come out because I'm running tomorrow. However, I'd really like to keep the training up after the marathon, which takes place the day before term begins. Josh and I have been incredibly disciplined when it comes to doing our training runs, mostly out of fear for the big day of running 26.2 miles and being rubbish at it, so the more training we do, the hopefully the easier it will be. But also, it's been really, really good to get out during the summer months in the sunshine um, and it's been really good for my mental health and although I haven't been particularly stressed over the summer, it is just great to get out and get that mental space as well as all of the physical benefits as well. I'd really like to keep that up once term begins because it's good for my stress levels um, but also I'd like to keep being as disciplined and hopefully some of that discipline will rub off on my studies as well which would be a benefit. <laughs> So anyway, this is what I've been up to over the summer, basically working and running. I've had a few comments recently from people asking questions about the foundation year and how that kind of works. So I think the next video that I make will address some of those questions and maybe focus on what the foundation year at Nottingham is actually like and what it entails. So if you have any questions regarding that, please comment below uh, and I'll do my best to answer them. Um, and as always, if you like the videos that I'm making, then please subscribe and I will keep making more of them. Okay, bye! <laughs>